This weekend was filled with Irish cheer in northeastern Pennsylvania, and the fun wrapped up earlier today in Wilkesbury. The Diamond City held its 43rd annual St. Patrick's Parade today, and the streets were absolutely packed for the last parade before the Irish holiday. Marchers hit the road at 2 p.m. and painted the city green along the way. 2822 Eyewitness News reporter Emily Allegrucci explains. The Diamond City shone green as those who came out to celebrate their Irish roots took over the streets. It's so wonderful to see so many friends and neighbors in Wilkesbury. The streets are lined, the excitement is pounding, and so we can't wait for the parade to start. Wilkesbury's annual St. Patrick's Day parade brought out hundreds, with some enjoying the fun for the very first time. I like the music, the energy. There's a lot of families here, which is really cool. Yeah, just like experiencing the city is a lot, a lot of fun. We have a lot of them on Long Island where we're from, but this is the biggest one I've seen besides the New York City one, and it's really cool. The more seasoned parade goers come back to see the crowd of green fill the city. I just like seeing everyone here together, all celebrating, having a good time. It's a good way to celebrate it. It's a good way to get the community together. And children love the sights and sounds that surround them as the parade marches on. It's mostly fun because everybody starts screaming and getting all excited about everything and it's just amazing. And they all have one common thing they hope to get lucky enough to bring home, candy. It's really fun uh, for everyone because you can uh, get a lot of candy and you could see uh, a lot about um, St. Patrick's Day. In Wilkes-Barre, Emily Allegrucci, 2822 Eyewitness News. The streets of Wilkes-Barre are now empty following the annual parade, but many parade goers say they look forward to attending again next year.